you don't want to hang out with us? Thanks, but I have a lot of work to do. I'm gonna try and fix my gadgets. Fair enough. Just shout if you need anything. All right. What are you gonna be up to? Oh, we should have plenty of things to do, especially with a new girl around. I'm bored. How about a movie? Sure! Mm, why not? What kind of movies do you like, Mila? I like being surprised! Alright, I think I have just the thing. I've got to save that? How come George You're doesn't want to know right, with us? He said he had some work to do. Eh, he's probably just scared of getting cooties. Cooties? <laughs> Not like a couple traitors like yourselves would care. Lilac! Lilac! <laughs> Torxa! I mean, I went down there and, and he's a, um, I mean... Calm he's... down, what is it? Tork turned into an alien or something! <sighs> what? Just come with me, come on! <sighs> I probably had a bad dream. I'm serious! Get up! Come on! Get up, get up! All right! Let me get my shoes on! Torque? No! <laughs> it's not what it looks like! What are you? Give us answers, buddy! Okay, okay! I'll tell you! But you have to promise to keep it to yourselves! We promise? Right, Carol? Mmm, right. Pinky swear. <sighs> All right. Take a seat. I'm from another world. Actually, I'm part of an alliance between many different worlds. We're called Chasers. So you're an alien, then? Pretty much, yeah. Space cooties! <laughs> you don't believe me. Actually, I do. Really? They say that a long time ago, dragons came to Avalis and mixed with our ancestors. And not just ones like Lilac, huge ones like in the movies! So I guess it's not much of a stretch for other things to be out there too. I see. So, why do a bunch of aliens care about our planet? The man that wants your kingdom stone isn't from around here either. He calls himself Lord Brevin. Lord? Well, he didn't get that name selling cookies. He's dangerous with a capital D. Revan is the most powerful enemy we've ever faced. Hundreds of worlds destroyed. Thousands of heroes killed or corrupted. Enormous amounts of weapon energy stolen. And that's just the tip of the iceberg. According to our scans, the Kingdom Stone has enough energy to double the size of his army. If he gets it, he'll be unstoppable. I'll try and convince your leaders of his existence, but if I can't get them to help me, if Brevin gets his hands on the Kingdom Stone, then I'll have no choice. I'll have to destroy it. Destroy, destroy it? it? You can't be serious! I'll only destroy it if I have no other choice. I swore to my captain on his dying breath that I would not let Brevin get that stone. I'm sorry about your captain, but you can't destroy it. In fact, you won't even have to think about it, because I'm going to help you get it back! I don't care how dangerous it is! It's going to take a lot more than robots and aliens to slow a dragon down! If she's going to go for it, then I am too! If we can beat up a giant praying mantis thing together, then who knows what else we can do! I want to come too! I guess we could let you save Carol's life a few more times. Hey! Yay! So the three of you are really gonna help me stop him? Say no more, Team Lilac's got your back! We'll talk about the name later, okay? I'd be lying if I said I was comfortable with this, but I honestly could use your help. You all know this world better than I do. So, it's official, right? <laughs> more or less. Welcome aboard, ladies! Yes! Awesome! Wonderful! Just remember something really important. Don't talk about our mission unless I say so. We do not want the whole world thinking we're crazy. Understood. Uh -oh. I don't know about you guys, but I'm exhausted. 
Yeah, we'd better get some shut-eye. We've got a big day ahead of us. Good evening, sir. It may interest you to know that the location of the artifact has shifted. Where? It's moving toward a densely populated region to the east. This could work to our advantage. Get me the king's son. Where do your duties lie, prince? It is my duty to protect my father's kingdom. You would sacrifice your very life for the good of this kingdom, wouldn't you? Yes. And you would crush all those who threaten its safety. We must protect it at all costs. Exactly. The one you call Sao has taken something very precious. Something that could put your kingdom at risk. You're not going to let him keep it, are you? Revenge is upon us, my fellow kin. We have confirmed who is responsible for the death of our king. Zhao of Shanmu! His plans to steal our kingdom stone must be stopped! Deploy your sky battalion! Hey, up and at him! We've got adventuring to do! Oh, five more minutes. I was wondering when you'd be awake. You can blame Carol for that. She sleeps for like half a day. <sighs> totally worth it. Well, anyway, I got a call from that big panda guy I told you about. He's gonna help us. When is he coming? Actually, we have to go meet him. He'll be waiting for us north of here. Perfect. I fixed my radar last night so we can use it to find the meeting point. Great! Ready, girls? Aye, aye, Captain. According to the radar, we seem to be at the right location. Um, I think it's a little off. This way! She's got a good nose. I'll say. Allow me to properly introduce myself. I am General Gong of Shang Tu. It's an honor, General. The Royal Magister has a proposal. We'd like you to help us get the stone back. It's in the greedy little hands of Man Zhao, in our neighbor city, Shang Mu. Why do you need our help? Don't you have soldiers and spies and stuff? We want to try and resolve this thing peacefully if we can, so we're sending a neutral party to negotiate. Given the uh, current state of affairs in Shui Gong, they're out of the picture. So you need us to fly to Shang Mu and convince Zhao to give the stone back. Precisely. Let's give it a shot. Right. I assume we'll be taking one of these planes. Uh-huh. You do know how to fly it. Of course I do. <laughs> Good. When you get there, head straight for the city hall. Y yes sir. Quack. Hope you're not afraid of heights. Just had to follow me here, didn't you? How did you know we were coming? You seemed pretty determined to get that stone back. So you're the thief Lilac was talking about. I've been called worse. Where is it? I've already finished the job. It's time for my brother to play his hand. Your brother? Prince Dale of Shuigon. Really? When he finds the man who murdered our father, there will be no mercy for the kingdom responsible. We know who's responsible. Nice try. Will you just hold on a minute and let us explain? What, so you can throw me off again with your lies? Thanks, but I've had enough. Everyone, split up! 
We'll cut him off with a huge shopping mall over there. Got it.
Did you see that? You were like, take that! And I was like, pow, pow! Not so fast, Commander! <laughs> if you're searching for the stone, you might want to look up. Those airships would ghost us from a mile away. Remember what happened to me in the valley? There has to be a way. What about Mayor Zhao? It's gone! My one chance for re-election is gone! <laughs> you! Over there! He's royalty? You have to bow! Oh! Very good. <clears throat> Rise. Were you the ones who disposed of this wretched mechanical beast? You bet we are. Glorious! As a token of my appreciation, I offer each of you free Rain Over Zhao Shopping Paradise! Uh, with this coupon, for 5% off selected brands! Aw, oh, what the heck? Why don't I just invite you over to dinner? My treat! I am pretty hungry. What about the stone? That scoundrel prince took it from me! I won't even be able to chase him until my ships are repaired! Well, Mayor Zhao, we would be honored to be your guest this evening. Follow me, then. I shall drown your sorrows in delicious chow mein. <laughs> 